Now we're at one of the most popular shows on the Universal Tour, The Stunt Show. The three participants could be labeled the instructor, who sets up the scenes, the bad guy, who wears black, of course, and the clown, who's everyone's favorite. Let's listen in as the instructor describes how they prepare for a film fight. Today we thought we would set up one of the basic elements of our business, that is the motion picture stunt fight. When we're called upon to do this, we go through a period of rehearsing that we call blocking out a fight. And this all means that we go through the fight routine many times, in slow motion, of course, until we have complete confidence in each other's movement. Then and only then will we put the fight on film. You'll notice that Steve's fist goes for the man's face. Brian will snap his head to the side. Snap! Ow! And the punch we like to use is the one to the midsection. That punch is delivered in this manner. Steve approaches his target, he will pull the punch or bounce it off. At the same time, Brian can tighten up the midsection, perhaps to let out a breath of air. <laughs> Once again, it would look like this. Oh. <laughs> I got red in the eyes. What follows is a fun-filled fight scene packed with surprises, action, and a comedy twist. Get out of here! Well, I don't like it! I don't care what you like! I'm the boss! You're nothing! Well, how about that? Boss over nothing! <laughs> Order. Okay, give me hot dog and a soda pop. Loosen up and get into this. Yeah, loosen him up. Slow motion, get the timing. Slow motion. Ah! Oh. Ah! Ooh. He said slow motion. I don't care what he said. Well, I'm not going to do it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Oh. Wait a minute. Whoa, ha, ha. Ah. 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 Come on, Steve. Ah. It's none of your business. If I come over there, you'll think it's my business. Get over here. Yeah. Right here. Yeah. Oh. The action builds to a fast-paced climax, which ends when the bad guy gets what's coming to him. Meanwhile, on another part of the entertainment center area, another popular hero prepares for his show. Coming up next, The Incredible Hulk. The Universal Studios Tour Makeup Show features a dramatic demonstration of how motion picture makeup works. As we join the performance, a man and a woman have been selected from the audience to be made up as the Frankenstein monster and the bride of Frankenstein. The Incredible Hulk, who everyone expected earlier, is late. All right. If you guys are ready, let's take the capes off. <laughs> let's turn the chairs and give them a look. Voila. I think Mike likes it. <laughs> Margaret! Oh! You're so pretty. Come here. Are you embarrassed? <laughs> it's gonna get worse in a second. <laughs> I want you to turn right over here. Keep, look right this way for those cameras. Smile over there. Don't turn. Frankie, right, come down here and join us. Oh, how nice. Italian sandals with a gray suit. <laughs> nice touch. <laughs> Frankenstein, I want you to turn to meet. You got a new bra. Uh, yeah. Give her a little kiss there, Mike. Go for a little monster kiss and a hug. The cat's by so nice to have these two. I'm sorry, folks, I can't keep you here any longer, though, because we have another show starting right away, uh, right next door. Um, the only thing I can suggest is if you come back to the next show, maybe you'll show up. Uh, <laughs> look, if you're not missing anything, it's no big deal. No, really, I'm being very honest with you. Now, all that other stuff is a script, I have to say that, but honest, the guy's more like the Bulk than the Hulk. He really is. No, he really is. He's like the Jolly Green Giant, you know, big green, kind of slow, kind of... Ah! A 
little makeup, add a little imagination, add up to a lot of fun at Universal Studios. But now, let's go to the show that lets the audience participate in the creation of the performance at the Screen Test Theater and Airport 77. Actors chosen from the audience perform in a condensed version of Airport 77. Their scenes are intercut with actual takes from the movie. Right now, we're at the point in this movie where Jack Lemmon has just worked his way to the surface. Now, he is about to signal the Navy to let the Navy know where the sunken plane is located. I'd like all of the men in the plane to move over here by the table. I'd like the first three of you to kneel shoulder to shoulder right down there by the table. You're looking out a window and you're watching for the Navy divers. You know that they're out there somewhere. Uh, when I point to you, I want all six of you to point right back to me, and all of you, all at the same time, say, they're divers out there. They're coming for us. Roll it. Men, lean forward. Looking out the window through the water. The Navy's going to lift the plane up off of the bottom of the ocean. Stewardesses kneel down, hold on to somebody or something. Water's leaking into the plane. You're not out of this yet. Passengers, when I give you the cue, I want all of you to jump to your feet. Everybody jump up. Real tight. Squeeze. Squeeze. Tight. Tight. Cut. Print. That's a take. Good job. Let them know, huh? Very good. This concludes our visit to Universal Studios. Now that you've had a chance to learn how movies are made, I know you'll enjoy your next film even more. It's been our pleasure to share our secrets with you, and we hope that this insight into our techniques and behind-the-scene glimpse of Hollywood in action will heighten your appreciation of the fabulous land of make-believe that's Hollywood. Our job is to entertain you both on and off the screen. We hope you've enjoyed your stay with us and that you'll come back often. So long, everybody.